Hey everyone, I'm Matt. Welcome back to another video today. I am super excited. We are taking a look at what I am calling the leisure travel van killer when it comes to RVs. This is a 2023 Thor Gemini all-wheel drive model 23TE, which is the same floor plans, same footprints, but $70,000 cheaper than the competition. We are gonna be taking a look at the outside features first, then the inside features, then we're gonna give you three things we love about this Gemini and three things we dislike about it. We're starting in three, two, one. Hey everyone again, welcome back to another video again today. I am super excited to be taking a look at this awesome Thor Gemini. I'm calling it the leisure travel van killer, the pleasure way killer, because there is so much that this small unit has to offer at an affordable price point. Before I begin, let's say hi to Andrea. Hey Andrea. Hi everybody. How's it going today? It's going good. And and I think you forgot to say that there is not a two, three year wait either. Right. Which is great. Cause I know, you know, the leisure van is very popular. And don't get me wrong. I love a leisure as much as everybody. Yes. But when I give somebody $10,000, for a deposit, I want to go camping exactly. right away. You know what I'm saying? You want to be waiting a couple years. Right. So what I recommend for all those pleasure way must have people, place your order, wait five years, but while you're waiting, get one of these yes. in the meantime in between Good time. Idea. Andrea, without further ado, let's begin. Andrea, model is 23 TE. The actual tip tip length of this motor home is 23 feet seven inches. This on the sits on the four transit chassis has a 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost, 310 horsepower, and it is all wheel drive. Andrea, look at the front of this chassis. I think it looks fantastic. New for 2023 part two is this smoked out headlight. I think it looks great. I think it looks mean and aggressive. And I just love the way this chassis drives. This is so much better than a class B motor home because it still drives like a class B, but you got all this space on the inside. Similar to a Class B, you don't have a bunk over the cab. You do have a nice smooth profile with that Gemini, and I believe that's a front windshield, Andrea. We will check on the inside. Coming on down here, we don't have any side cameras. You can see that there's no side cameras on the side or in the mirror. Again, this is very van life. Look at these tires, Andrea, they're hand cooked. Dyna Pro. I love those. LT 205 wow. 75R. 16c wow that's a different tire for sure yes ma'am right there is the shiny rims and then look at this look at this smooth profile right here andrea it's this much wider on both sides than a b-van but once we show you the insides you guys won't believe how much space this little bit gets you you know what i'm saying coming on down here you can see that it is fiberglass sides um with a nice power awning with led lights and what's nice about that awning, Andrea, is that there is a wind sensor. So if the awning blow, if the wind blows too hard, that awning will retract itself back in. You do have frameless windows throughout this motorhome. 12 year structural warranty from Thor, six year lamination warranty. Very nice. And then here we got a little bit of storage. And then there, Andrea, we do have a propane tank or a propane quick connect if you do want to have a grill on the outside. Right here, we do have power outlets. And then do you know what this is? The generator? Yes, ma'am. Onan 4000 nice. generator. Coming around the back, Andrea, we do have a nice automotive style design. Oh, dang nabbit, Andrea. No ladder to get up on the roof. Very simple outside. We do have a 5,000 pound hitch. I don't recommend you towing 5,000 pounds with this motorhome. Again, you're getting the Ford Transit, so it's easy to drive, you know? Backup camera there. It is a one piece TPO roof and a very simple design you know and andrea it really what this motorhome is is simplicity for people who like this style this footprint that don't want to spend two hundred thousand plus you guys are going to absolutely love it. just wait for the price right here we got a coax 30 amp power cord single ac unit coming on down here we got city water connection black tank flush potable water fill potable potable Instant hot tankless water heater right there. Outdoor shower. And then here's where you uh, dump your valves and everything. Good job with the paint and the decals. Yes, ma'am. Fan-freaking-tastic. Guys, 
this is what we look for. When you when you add something like this, just continue the decal, you know? Isn't that an instant tankless? It is. Nice. Right over here, we got a little bit of storage from the outside, because especially on these small motorhomes, you can never have enough. Never, never, never. Right there, we got more storage. And then right there, Andrea, this is your propane tank, just like that. And Miss Jennifer, bing! If you could put all the specs of this motorhome right there so everybody can see who is watching on TV. And Matt, I'm gonna have you just open this up real quick. Yes, Thank you. Show us what we got going on so there. We got the fuel fill up right there. You can see you got a nice step to get in. Yep. Storage, and then there's the seat. Well, Andrea, the outside of this motorhome looks great, but it is the inside that looks even better. Let's go take a look. All right, I'm excited to see this. Yes, ma'am. This new floor plan. Check it out. All right, we're probably to get the cargo on the door. Okay, so I'm just gonna turn right here just so we can see this little cab. And interesting handle coming in. All right, guys, look. So this slide is in, and it is a little bit of a, a tight getting through here, but doable. You can definitely open the fridge. And here is the bathroom. Okay. And Andrea, 1,771 pounds cargo carrying Pretty capacity. good. And Andrea, this is a huge wall slide. While we get this slide out, out, let's give a big shout out to the sponsor of this episode. This episode is sponsored by RV Life Pro. RV Life Trip Wizards allows you to carefully plan your RV trip before you go. It will show you every campground along the route and let you plan important aspects of your trip like fuel, rest stops, break areas, and more. Know before you go with satellite views, street views, elevation, and grade charts. Then use the RV Life app to navigate your dream trip exactly the way you planned it. We are doing a free seven day trial and 25% off with promo code Matt's RV Reviews, no spaces. Thank you so much to RV Life for sponsoring us. Let's continue the video. Andrea, just like that, look at how spacious this RV is. It really is when you open the slide up. It's unreal to think we're only in a 23 footer. I freaking love it. Let's get started with my favorite cockpit area on this Ford Transit. Andrea, I love this Ford Transit because it resembles the Mercedes, but it is a lot cheaper. It handles so well, it drives so well. They were getting 10 miles a gallon. I know you can get even better than that when you uh, drive a little bit slower. You got power windows here, adjustable locks. Here's where you can control your mirrors. Love this big screen. This is gonna have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, navigation, Sirius XM radio, everything that you want. Uh, cup holders here. Andre, how do you feel? I feel fine. You know, I feel like, you know, it's, it's a little small up here, but you know, it's definitely, doable because of the ride that you're getting in this yes and the places you can fit so it's it's comf the chair's comfortable i just feel like i don't know i'm enclosed in okay okay right there we do have cup holder little cup holder some storage there yes ma'am and yeah no bunk over the cab no we do have a button for the shade love but that look, look up there i absolutely love this the one thing you can never buy in an RV is natural light, right. so I love that feature about that. We did forget to mention that both of those seats do swivel. Absolutely. And I love how the backup camera is right here, um, because again, muscle memory, that's right. what you're looking at when you're backing up. All right, over here we have like a little cubby up there. Yes. And there is your pad that controls everything. Here's your seats, so once these seats do swivel, it kind of boosts you up so you're a part of the living room area. And then Andrea, please stand over here. Yes, I just noticed that with the floor. Well, not just that. It's not It's not like, unless the carpet's covering it, but is the floor flush? No, it's not. It, okay. it, it is elevated some, but it's like a smooth elevation. But Andrea, remember what I said on the outside? This much wider yep. than a B-Van, but you have all this space. I cannot do this in a B-Van. You know what I'm saying? Right here, we do have a nice max fan. Right over here is a sofa, and it does convert to a Murphy bed. We will show you that in just a little bit. Right over here, we have a USB place to charge your phones, and a little bit of storage up here and on the other side. Over here, and this is kind of 
your kitchen area. You can use this for a ton of kitchen countertop space. We're gonna show everybody the ward dog pantry above. Very nice. Nice looking balances. We do have slow rise shades there. And let's get a good look at these balances. Mm, Andrea? Approved! Ding! Oh, Andrea loves these Thor, balances. I will say it is time to change your balances. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. It's been it's been a while with hey, those. You know, some people think if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But we hear what you're saying and we'll see if Thor listens. Right here we do have a wireless phone charger. A TV on the televator. We will show you that look in just a moment. This is interesting. Wow, look at that. And look at wow. that floor. Very okay. nice. So that's something you don't see. I like there's adjustable shelves in there, but you don't see this normally. Wow, very nice. Use box. Now let's see if we can find the button for the TV. Yes. You would think it would be over here somewhere, you but would think. I will say, Matt, that it's neat that they gave you the little pedestal table that goes here in front of the sofa, since you don't have a dinette. All right, Andrea, we found it. It is on the screen, and the TV and the uh, engine does need to be off. But just like that, Andrea, you push the button, and it's coming all the way up. What I love about this TV, Andrea, is that it's directly across from the sofa and from the bed when it does turn into a bed. And look at the size of this TV. Very, nice. very nice. And then I'm sitting here. Also, I see on this side there's a wireless charger. Do you have a wireless charger on that side? Uh, no, but there is an electrical outlet down there. Okay, okay. And there's also that USB in there, so. Yes, and Andrea, we are going to make this into a bed in a little bit after we show you the kitchen. And you know what we do before the kitchen? It's now time, time for, for the, the MSRP. MSRP. Burr, 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 burr. The moment that you guys all been waiting for. And we All are right. not we're we not gonna up for this. We're not gonna disappoint. Andrea, MSRP on a motorhome like this is one hundred and forty nine thousand three hundred and eighty five dollars. Andrea. MSRP. MSRP. Current sale price, we have it discounted to one nineteen nine nine five, which again is fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars cheaper than the competition like this. But Andrea, I know we can get everybody an uh, even better price than that. So if you guys are interested, all you got to do is go to generalrv.com slash Matt's Cash. I've linked that website down in the YouTube description below. You can get there from mattsrvreviews.com or you can call 844-969-4033. Please reach out to us any way you can. Our team is here to help people get the absolute best price in America. So please reach out to us. And again, Andrea... If this is the right footprint that you're looking at, and you're looking at any of those Airstream Atlases or Pleasure Ways or Leisures, let me tell you, I will tell you this. Those units are better than this unit, right? The question is, is it $70,000 better? That's a lot of money. It sure is. Andrea, show us the kitchen. Okay. Up here we have some storage. Oh, I just broke my nail. Oh, Again. no. Yeah. Are you okay? I'm okay. Uh, adjustable shelves. Keeping your composure too. Let's see it. Let's see the broken nail. Oh, oh. It's, it's just like the tip of it. Oh. It's okay. It's okay. Dang it, Thor. <laughs> and then above here we have another cabinet with adjustable shelf. I like, you know, there's a lot of light in here with these windows. You did. Oh, wait, did we do the shades? We did. It's just a privacy okay. shade. And then look, there's a tower of power. Hey, that's a nice tower of power right there. We've got a round sink here with an extension. Yes, ma'am. And you know, there is a little bit of counter space right there. Okay. We've got, oh. Hey, that's a $156 trash can. A trash can. And then we've got, oh, three drawers. One, two, and three. Very nice. And then a Dometic, I think it's a two burner propane cooktop. Wow. I hate these covers. Yep, you always want to make sure yeah. you lift up before yeah, you close it. Yeah, lift up before you close it. Yeah, yep. I just... I know. I, I just know. feel like they could shatter very easily. And then right here, this is a convection microwave. Yes, ma'am. Okay, and then there's a drawer here. Very, Good very size. nice. And then behind us, we've got the... Um, okay, this is interesting. Yes. What is this? It's a, a Norcold. Norcold. 
Oh my goodness. Nice little fridge, Look Andreas. It's this a little motorhome. Yeah. Wow, this is way better than those little ones that we see with the little teeny right, tiny Right, right. I like what they did yes. there. Yes. That is great. And I bet you this is a compressor, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's definitely a okay. three-way fridge. We've got a drawer. And then here, Matt, I guess this is like your wardrobe. For sure. There's your pedestal, the table for the where the sofa is. And then we got another drawer here. Yes, ma'am. And then another drawer here. Yes, ma'am. So uh, the one thing I do want to mention, again, there's no countertop in the kitchen. But in a small motorhome like yes. this, you use this for the countertop and you make it work. No different than there's no dinette, but that table, this is where the dinette is. Your sofa becomes your dinette and your sofa placement becomes where your bed is. Did somebody say Murphy? Oh, oh. yeah. Charlie Murphy. There we go. Just like that. Okay. And looks bada like bing. it has, bada boom. And it's got the little um, oh. rails, the wooden slats there, so it should be more comfortable. The, yes. the mattress actually is not bad. Not that bad. You got a window right up there, nice blinds, a little bit of storage behind there. And again, look, you got the little clippies, so the bed to come in, very, very nice. Andre, this is such a nice setup. And if you back up, you can see, even with the bed down, you still have plenty of walk space here. Wow. Andre, does it get much simpler than it that? It does not, Matt. I mean, that's pretty simple. And then here's the other cushion. Yes, thank you. Nice artwork on the bed. And then let's check out, this has to be one of the biggest class B bathrooms in the RV industry. Look at this, Where's this whole door? thing. Oh, it's a pocket door. Okay. We've got a nice pocket door right here. We have a nice oh, 24 no. by 36 shower. Okay, it's not a bad size shower, but we do have the curtain. We'll touch on that in just a moment. Nice, uh, again, instant hot tankless water heater, which is really nice for a small motor home like this. Nice medicine cabinet here. Yeah, that's a pretty good size. Heck yeah. Oh, we got liquefied. Yay. Guys, go to primepoopposition.com. It is the absolute best black tank treatment in the RV industry. Trust us. Right there, we got a sink. A little bit of storage there. Oh, and please? guess what, Andrea? What? If you don't trust us, check out the NRVTA because they did a side-by-side -side comparison against Unique and there was only one winner. That's right. We're not going to tell you guys who, <laughs> but check out that video. Over here, there's some more storage. Good yes, place for linens. Nice window right here. Okay, look at all the um, little cubbies behind you. Unfortunately, it's a plastic toilet and I'll try a womp womp on that plastic toilet. Do you know why? Because it can't get the four Ps. But it is a very nice toilet placement. And I get it. This made to be ultra lightweight, but I would definitely swap this out for a porcelain toilet. Because, Andrea, this bathroom, especially for a B van, is fan freaking tastic. Andrea, this is definitely one of my favorite motorhomes at a phenomenal price. But, Andrea, guess what? That's it. That's the review. Now, before everybody leaves, it's time we give people three things we love about this motorhome and three things we just don't like about it. Andrea, what do we do first? Uh, let's do three things that we like about it first. First. Yes. I'm in it. Okay. This whole bathroom. This bathroom in the rear is fan freaking tastic. If you stand over here, Andrea, please take a look again. We got a toilet, a nice sink, nice shower. It's pretty spacious for how little this motorhome is. 23 feet, seven inches. Andrea, this is smaller than my truck in length. You know what I'm saying? And to have a bathroom this size is amazing. That is number one. Andrea, what's number two? Number two for me is going to be, I love this setup here. Yes. A lot of times when I see these uh, floor plans with the Murphy bed, the TV right. is often in a weird place. Yes. You know, and sometimes you can't see it from the bed. Yes. It'll be over here or over there. So I like the fact that it's here and it's on a televator. And it adds to your countertop yeah, space. It, it looks nice. It makes, this makes it look really uh, homey in here. For sure. Yeah. Hanging with my homies. <laughs> and Andrea, number three is going to be this. This much wider, driving down the road, but you got all this space. I can't tell you how much I love it. And again, there is competitors that make a floor plan like this, and they are $200,000, 175, yep. 190. The fact that you can get all of this for less than 120, I freaking love that. And Thor really did knock it out of the park with this brand. 
Andrea, that's three things we love about it. Now it's time for three things we don't like about it. Womp, 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 womp. May I go first? Sure. I love the Murphy bed, but unfortunately, um, the bed's too big, which isn't a bad thing. But you cannot use the bed with the slide out closed. Right. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. It really isn't that big of a deal. I would just put the slide out out every time. But if you're pulling, you know, but sometimes it is nice. Sometimes if you're doing docking, you can't right. always put your slide out. I mean, but you can, you know, because it's only. This it's one's not, not that very one, big. Right. Yeah. It's not very big. But still, it's just like it would have been nice to be able to do it with the slide out closed. But then you would have lost a ton of storage. That is number one. Andrea, dislike number two. You know, I'm going here. Talk to me. Um, I do not like the shower curtain. Yeah. At all. Um, I just, I prefer Nautilus type shower of course. doors or curtains or whatever. Yep. Dislike number three, Andrea, is going to be this cooktop. You know, we are not a huge fan of this. I don't like this. And this is like the most annoying thing right here. Like, if you push too hard, the whole thing's going to shatter. You literally need to lift up like that to get it closed. Well, Andrea, that's it. Oh, excuse me. Thank you. That's the review. Now, if you guys are interested in this unit, all you guys got to do is go to generalrv.com slash Matt's Cash. I've linked that website down below. You can get there from mattsrvreviews.com or you can call 844-969-4033. Please reach out to our team, Andrea, because our team is here nationwide to help people get the absolute best price in America. Andrea, what do you want to say? Hey, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know the three things that you like about this RV and the three things that you dislike. Yes. Thor does read the comments. They do watch the videos, so make sure you leave your feedback. I hope you guys are safe and well. Thanks for watching. Thank you absolutely everybody so much for watching. And Andrea, we'll see you next time. Bye.